Hey guys, so today we are going to be spring cleaning my bathroom. When I was spring cleaning last week, I realized there's places that need to be deep cleaned. So that's what we're going to do today. I have my extension wand. That's what we got to do first is change this before we do anything. And I have a bucket. Uh, this is my favorite cleaner. Lysol that has the perioxide in it, like the peroxide. It smells very clean and fresh. My toilet bowl cleaner. We're doing a shower, toilet, tub. I was going to do some spring cleaning outside on the porch, but it is raining, so we probably won't get to that today. It may or may not be in this video. If it's not, it's probably going to be a short video, but that's all right. So let's get to work. So first, this is my favorite tool. This is a hack. This is what saves my back and my stomach. I have severe stomach issues. And my biggest fear is, um, it was like 10 years ago, I was cleaning a tub one morning, a big tub, like the one we're gonna clean today. And I was bending over it, scrubbing, and pain came over me so bad, I had to be rushed to the hospital and I got hospitalized and they never really found out what it is. I think I found out what it is, but I'm gonna have to do that in a whole nother video. This is a little bit conspiracy theory stuff, but they kept me in the hospital three days. They told me not to eat meat, raw meat, and that's all they said. They couldn't figure out what it was. My blood, um, white blood count was really bad. That's why they kept me and I was in a lot of pain. They ran a lot of antibiotics through me for those three days and I haven't ate pork since. Cause I was eating a lot of pork at the time. I do eat pork here and there, but I don't eat much. So yeah, I've got a new sponge for it. And I was going to um, use this old one here, but it is I didn't even want to show on video. <laughs> it's been used anyways. You know, I told you I wipe this down every day and rinse it out and I keep the door open. Some old don't form, but you don't get up there and it's very dirty up there. And then there's, you know, there's buildup in here, so... That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna spring clean this, but first, I have to get all this stuff out of it. Before I get sweat, I'm going to dry dust up here. Probably need to get a new filter for that, too. Now I'm going to rinse it because it's got cat litter in it. It's where I keep my cat's litter box. I only take a shower in here, wash my hair in here like once a week. I wash my hair unless it needs it, although it's twice a week. But if it don't need it, I'm not going to wash it. But um, I take baths in the bathtub the rest of the time. Just some mornings when I'm in a hurry, I just wash with the washcloth. I ain't ashamed to say, if I'm going to work, and I'm in a rush, and now I'm gonna get sweaty. I just wash my face and my important body parts and good. Now, if I'm going to a doctor's appointment or something, I'm getting good and clean. That's some real city. So I went and got this. I had this in the, um, this is my cleaning bucket for work. I'm gonna use some of this in there. It's a dollar twenty-five at the Dollar Tree. 
I usually show y'all where I get this stuff, but I don't think I have that recording still. I haven't seen it in a while, so I think I erased it. But yeah, if you need a little more, I need it in some spots. But when you use the stuff, you gotta rinse. Yeah, that works. That's working really good. Let's see if it'll get that stuff off. Those spots. I think that's where they have something stuck. I got my other sponge now. This will work on that um, power head. Just to get a little extra. You probably don't want to see me down here. That's an outside. Part. That's where the stuff is in the scene. Alright, now we have the same. Last week we did the countertops and the mirrors. And this week we're gonna do the same. The countertops don't need to be done. We just did those. We put them in. So now I rinse everything down and I spray it. And then on these problem areas, I'm gonna put some of that paste if I can find it. Do not there it is. Uh, and put it on your metals that will help shine it up and get any water spots off of it works really well I'll show you in another video right now of uh, one I did and it looked brand new which it is brand new but they already destroyed it in water spots which we don't we usually get when we're just cleaning real quick. And I'm still wiping down the dominoes after. This might be clean up. Next is the toilet. First, we're gonna dust it off, which is pretty. It should be fine. I just dusted it yesterday, but the kitty got tired to come in here and drag out the toilet. So you know my toilet is clean, but it is not these lines. But I, it don't bother me. It's from the water. But I got my ice saw. Put that in here. 
toothbrush. And I'm going to vacuum this carpet because there is carpet around this tub. And I'll show you another day what I do about keeping that carpet fresh. But right today we're only vacuuming and then deep cleaning the tub. Of course, you know, I've got to always make the greatest racket first. No, that would be annoying. All this stuff. It needs to be vacuumed back there because the salt has spilled down there. Please stop. So now we're gonna, I already rinsed it this morning, so I'm, I might rinse a minute. And if you want to know what that gray stuff is, it's um, J.P. Well, because it was the crack, it was a crack. I got the wrong stuff, but hey, it worked. I suppose it got clear stuff. As long as it built in crack, I honestly don't care. I'm not particular like that. I can be, but I don't like to be. Gotta let the little things go. Kids out there playing. They got a basketball goal right in front of my house, across the street.
honestly don't feel good. I've been sick. My stomach. I'm having issues again. But I'm glad I'm doing it. Like once everything's clean, it's worth it. You gotta get up and do something. Alright, I honestly just make you feel worse. If you wanna feel better, you guys gotta keep going. It's the best advice I got. Right now. That's it, guys. Have a blessed day. Bye.